Salutations, my Saiyan squad! This is Saiyan Sonic 91, back for the finale of Let's Play Okage Shadow King. And my god, I'm fucking with camera. <laughs> anyway, in the last part, he managed to take out both the Phantom Evil King uh, Epros, and we managed to take on the Vampire Evil King. And now we're here in the World Library. We gotta take down Bellune. And immediately we get stuck in a freaking confrontation. Just my luck. But yeah, I'm mainly just gonna be running away from these. The, there is no real reason to fight these anymore. When you hit at least level 60, you're basically good to go for the rest of the game. Now, the World Library is kind of a pain in the ass, considering you need four keys in order to get through all of it. But your... Your mission... is to find the keys. And that's not as easy as it sounds. Try to get past these guys. I do believe that the one you have to head for first is the Emerald Key. There's the Emerald Key, the Garnet Key, the Sapphire Key, and the Amethyst Key. I believe that the Amethyst Key only opens up, like, one door. So, it's not that great, but it is the final key that you need. The one you have to get first, I believe, is the Garnet Key. And there's the Garnet Door, which we cannot, um, we cannot use. A Durhe. And yes, I am using a map, because trying to traverse this whole thing without one is a pain in the ass. Defense candy. Think of it as the uh, the vitamins from the Pokemon games. Speaking of which, how many do I actually have? I just have a power candy and a defense candy. Refined lemon flavor, barely sweet and grape flavor. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know why they had to add those in. Just to be cute, I guess. But since we're dodging all these, they're going to be coming faster and faster. Uh, truth be told, I probably won't be needing, like, any more LP for the rest of the f game, because... The uh, combined strat is actually quite good for the final boss. It doesn't exactly hit that hard. I might need to do like a defense buff or, s or something. But other than that, it's not going to be that big of a deal. When they call this place a library, they ain't whistling Dixie. Hello? Job is just to make a classification list, measure its effect, and adjust it. I'm not allowed to do anything else. You ever met people like us, a man who never listens to others and calls others whatever he likes? He was always thinking of a simple way to overthrow Bellune's rules, but not the torturous way of Pollock. Or Pollock. Then he made the decision and ran away from the library. I wonder how he's doing. I hope he's alive. Interesting. Oh, we get the Garnet Key. 
Thank God. One less thing we have to worry about. And you can use the Garnet Key over and over, it's not a one-use thing. Because that'd be a huge pain in the ass. Let's see. I gotta head over this way. Go to this door. I gotta head all the way down the side. So I believe that'll get us right next to another key. Ah, oh, Jesus! Earth shaking. Ideal. Honk. Whatever. I don't really need any more experience. I'm good for where I am. Is this the bottom one, or am I... Or am I losing it here? closest one. Yep, that's the bottom one. I keep second-guessing myself. I don't know if I'm going to be in the right spot or not. Well, might as well give it a shot, then. This will lead us back to the main, main room. The center. Another chest. The Emerald Key. idea of where we're supposed to be. <laughs> Bingo. Excuse me. Get a Cerberus Fang. I believe that, that raises our attack by three. Ten. Hush my mouth. I'm kind of good at where my uh, equipment's set. I have the Divine Shoes on Big Bull because I need him to be fast enough to kind of correlate with both Ari and Rosalind. Omni Booster on anyone's pretty good. <laughs> Except I think Divine Shoes raises agility by 10, whereas Omni Booster basically boosts everything by 5. And the first star badge helps you avoid physical and magical attacks. So that's why I have that on. A little bit easier, and I'm just going to be using a guidance jewel. Get right to the entrance. Let's see, let's see. I do need a couple more of those. I wish I could just just sit there and look at the damn map, but unfortunately I can't. The game won't let me... Alright, I gotta, 
I got a good idea of where I need to go. It's only if I can make it there without many more problems. separated from the power of classification. We couldn't find her either. Although he didn't show it, I know Bellalune is in pain. I understand that you are hostile to Bellalune, but keep that in mind. Then even if you still want to go, go. He'll be further in the back with intentions that we'll never know. I could have seen more of that whole situation just to get a more of a, I guess, better grasp on it, for lack of a better term. And this should be the sapphire key. Just one left. If I could find my direction. give you so much. I fear that the damn 
and ghosts can go for frickin' walls. Everything's against me. Never fails. I can probably just get to the other side now. Yeah, now I can go through this way. Continue to shuffle on this mortal coil. They had to make this annoying on purpose. Because they want to drag this out as much as possible. down all these fucking doors. Alright, I think I know where to go now. We can't get the MSS key this way. We'll have to go into Central for a little bit. see another book in my lifetime, I think I'm going to hurl. Burn the damn place to the ground. Let's see where this leads us. Be a man named Pollock. You remove important aspects of evil kings and heroes ruining Balune's world. Evil kings and heroes are important entities in the basis of this adventurous world for the princess. It used to make Balune really upset. Pollock thought the people classified by Balune were to be pitied. Take the rules away, he escaped. It's been several hundred years now. Even Although it was written within the classified time frame, Pollock tried to sneak into the gap between classifications at Bellune in order to transform the structure of power ruling the world. As if he was trying to break a boulder by driving a wedge into a crack. The great hero Hawkins was one of Pollock's wedges. Activity slowly transformed the world. Now here you are. If you're breaking Breaking the classifications of this world then must be the flow of the world. It's really desired by our company at the beginning. Maybe Pollock expected the, that and returned Hopkins' sword to the center building here. They say he had various goods all over the world that only this work could open. If you find the sword, go look for them. Yeah, I'm not exactly interested. I believe that all the sword really gives you is, yeah, an accessory that's not nearly as good as when you do the other side quests, and also Keesling's ultimate weapon. But since Keesling, let's face it, sucks ass, I'm not gonna bother with it. You're pretty much looking at the best party for the, uh, End game right here. And this shall give us the Amethyst Key. Now let's just warp all the way back to the beginning. Save myself the trouble. 
And the sword itself is the second best sword for Ari, but if you got the gear sword, then you're already good to go. We're putting an end to this nonsense right here and now. Bust open the amethyst lock. For right now, it's just gonna be a lot of running to the end. Don't know why they put doors like that here if you already have the key to open them. It's kind of just like stalling in a way. And I need more strawberries. Exit, exit, where can you be? Won't you come and release me? From this torture. Woo! Now I'll save just right here, just in case. Cause I don't want to go through all that again. Good. It's time to put an end to this, Bellune. Last we're here. <laughs> it's going down, brother. you find some. You practice before you talk. the damn door down. <laughs> oh god, James. That's been a long time. such as, this is a door. <laughs> huh. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty stunned too. Hey, it worked. Let's go! You 
wanted to talk, Aperos. Shit. Just trying to get them to kill each other. No way, I want to see this. I will admit that Stan looks a bit weird in a human form, though. <laughs> and no one's dying today. I got a few ideas. Like this. Just repeating themselves again. Now stop trying to kill each other. <laughs> wow, 
Rosalind doesn't really look all that different, except now she's a bit brighter. Not in terms of intelligence, I'm talking about in terms of luminosity. Because I'm the man. It's magic. I don't have to explain it. Lost his goddamn mind. Give me your best shot. Dan. Gonna need you in shadow form for this. 